Hello, hello. This is Mystic Moho. <clears throat> and I come to you today with the dang. Really? That's how you're going to treat my daughter? You're going to be disrespectful to my child? Oh, I got some words for you, Mama Masculine. So the two mamas is at battles with each other because Mama Comic feels like Mama Masculine doesn't know how to talk to her child and is disrespectful to the comic. So let's just get right into this drama because we wants to know why the mamas, Mama Comic and Mama Masculine, seem to act that way over grown children. All right. Oh God, my nose itchy. So Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come to you today. We would like to know the energies of Mama Masculine and Mama Comic. We would like to know why these two don't get along. We would like to know why are these two at battles because of their grown children. So what is the energies of Mama Masculine and Mama Comic? No, first let's see what is the energies of Mama Masculine. Okay. So Mama Masculine is in a Queen of Cups energy. And when one is in a Queen of Cups energy, a female, this is a female that may conceal her or hide her feelings towards another. She, however, she may be cold. She may be calculated. She may turn her back on those that she do not like. She can also be a sneaky woman. She can also be a woman that cares nothing about herself and steps on others to get what she wants. She's also an envious type of person. And do not trust her because she's hot and she's cold. And she will change just like the weather. So what is the energies of Mama Comet? Okay. So Mama Comic is in a Nine of Wands energy. And when one is in a Nine of Wands energy, one is in an energy where they preparing for assault. They being defensive. They surrounded by drama. They surrounded by uh, issues. They surrounded by a whole bunch of gossip and just a whole bunch of things is around this person. So what is the energies of both of the mamas together, Holy Spirit? And I think this is too loud. That's fine. All right. So, both of the mamas is in the moon energy. In reverse, I might add. And when both of the mamas is in the moon energy, both of the mamas is in the lies, energy, and deception energy. They feel like their securities is being under attack. They feel like their securities is at risk. They feel like their life is in disruption at the current time. And magic is indicated when the moon is in reverse. So let's just get right into it, honey. So we're gonna use to see the characteristics of these moms, how these moms act towards their children, and why do they feel like um, the other mother is being unfair to the children. So we're gonna use my cause today. We're gonna start this thing off with my cause. We're gonna use my dick diva cause, honey, because we wanna know what's going on with this family and this mama and all of these things that's going on. We are going to use these cards today to find out what's going on with the dick dealer. We gonna use my cards today to find out what's going on with this person and his mama and all these things that's going on in the life with this comic and this divine masculine. So let's just find this out, what's going on. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell us what's going on with the comic? Mama, what's going on with Divine Masculine's mama? We would like to know, how was these people childhoods? We will start there. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we would like to know, how was Mama Masculine and Mama Comic, how was they in their childhoods? How was their childhoods? How was these mamas? 
What is the characteristic of these mamas? Mm. So these mamas like to verbally abuse their children because the curse card that come out is verbally abused. So mama masculine and mama comic like to verbally attack their children. That is the first characteristic of the mama. What else does the mama do? And the mamas is receiving karma for how they treated their children with these verbal attacks and not knowing how to talk to their children. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what else do the mamas do? The mamas had the mamas because of how they treated their children and the verbal attacks and how they uh act during the children's childhood the children both the comic and divine masculine has vulnerability issues because how they were treated as children yes this is why the children gets into uh third parties and entanglements this is something that both of the children do because both of the children uh was verbally attacked and have vulnerability issues and they were they are vulnerable as adults maybe because these parents wasn't around oh at the bottom of the deck both of the mamas was abusive mamas this is why these people always have to have people around them and get into third parties and entanglements because they were abused by the mamas. Yes. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, yes. Let's both of the mamas. Let's get some characteristics. Let's break it down. Why these children act the way they do. Why did the mamas, where was, the, oops, that one went to fall. I was about to say, where was the mamas when these children was growing up? Oh, God. They was letting the sister get abused too. So this card wanted to come out. So if your divine masculine has a sister or the karmic, not only was the karmic getting abused, not only was divine masculine getting abused, but the siblings was getting abused also. What was these mamas out in the streets doing uh, while they was absent, while these kids? Oh, okay. Okay, so the mamas was absent and the daddies was narcissistic. Okay, so Holy Spirit, Holy Angel, let's just break it on down. We would like to have the characteristic of Divine Masculine's mother first. What was her characteristics and what and how was what kind of mother was she as a child? She was an abusive parent, Divine Masculine's mother. She was a druggy parent. Divine Masculine's mother. Okay, so Holy Spirit, since you wanted to give us the characteristics of Divine Masculine, give the, the characteristics of the comic, Holy Spirit. Oh, the comic's mother. We're not getting into the comic, but they say the, the karmic likes to fake flex, and the karmic is a player herself. But Holy Spirit, we want to know the characteristics of the comics mother we want to know what was the childhood like with the comics mother the mother is smothering this is the comics mother now the comics mother is in a toxic family and when the comics mother was in her heyday the comics mother didn't do no commitment in her life this is why her child does third parties and entanglements and things because she's seen her mother do it because this call came out for the mother and it came out in reverse, no commitment. Tell me some more characteristics of the comic mother. So the comic still cry over her childhood from how her mother treated her. How did the mother treat her? Oh. So this is why the comic may do uh, third parties and entanglements. This is all she may be accustomed to. Because the next call comes out is, I was taken advantage of sexually. This is the comic now. Okay, so Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, where was the comic? Oh, Lord, these wanted to fall. Where was the comic mother that she wasn't doing right by the kids? This is why the comic is always in entanglements and fighting people. This is why the comic likes, again, to fight people and be in an Ike-like energy. 
This is why the comic thinks that everybody wants her and everything is about sex because this is all she knows. But again, we want to know what was the comic mother out here doing that she was letting her child get molested and abused. And this call comes out again, molested. So not only was Divine Masculine molested, the comic was molested too. But again, Holy Spirit, we would like to know what was the comic mother out here doing in the streets that she was not taking care of her child. And this came in reverse. I was not protected as the child as a child says the comic. Okay, comic, but what was your mother doing out in the street that she wasn't protected you? And again, I felt unwanted as a child. Do you hear this, mama comic? This is how your child felt as a child. What was you doing? What was Mama Comic out here doing in these streets that her child wasn't protected and this one wanted to fold? I hurt. I'm hurt with my mom. Do you hear that, Mama Comic? Your child is hurt that you was not there for her. This is the next card that comes out for the comic child. What was Mama Comic doing? Please stop dancing around the situation. What was mama? And the comic said, this is why she stayed in low budget energy. This is why she pole danced. This is why she sell her body. Okay, mama, did you hear that? Again, why do mama comic, what was she doing in her lifetime that she let her child, that she let this abuse happen to her child? What was Mama Kami doing? What was she doing out here in these streets? What's she doing out in these Mama Kami streets? Mama Kami is saying she need counseling, but again, Mama Kami, you dancing around the situation. We want to know what was you doing out in here in these comic streets? What was you doing? What was you doing, Mama Kami, out here in these comic streets now? When you in your heyday, what was you out here doing, girl? Mm. You struggle with depression? I understand you struggle with depression, Mama Carmen. But can you please stop dancing around what you don't want us to know what you did to your child when she was a child? Again, Mama Comic says she has depression. She has depression for what she did to her to her child. Okay, so again, what did you do to your child? She gave her child violent punishments. This is what Mama Comic did. What else did you do to her child when she when she was a child? I witnessed things I shouldn't have seen as a child. So. Because Mama Comic was out there doing her thing, this comic seen some things as a child that she wasn't supposed to see. Now, now let's get into why both of y'all is over here fighting. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, now that we know both of the mamas was not around and let these horrible things happen to their kids as adult, let us know what's going on with them now. Why they don't accept each other's uh 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 partners holy spirit why they don't accept each other's partners why shit i ain't accepting this this too much why they don't accept each other's um partners holy spirit in the adult life why mama masculine has an issue with the calm that would be a great place to start why does mama masculine has an issue with the comic. Oh, she says she have an issue with you comic because you a damn manipulator and you ain't good at it because this came in reverse. Whatever issues, oh, she said you a liar. Mama Maskin said you are a plum liar and you ain't good at it, you get caught in your lies. What else, Mama Comic, do you have with this one? Mm. She says she's seen the many faces of your fuckery comic. This is why she don't like you. The next call comes out is many faces of fuckery. She said I have seen every one of those comics. 
what else do you have to say about this comment that you don't like about her mama masculine? She says she don't she don't like you because when you get mad at her child, you act like a woman scorned. What else you don't like, Mama Masculine? And she's saying she know about all these men, all these people that you have had sex with because the next card that comes out is too many bodies. I lost count. Damn, that's messed up when somebody mama know you done been out here with a whole lot of people. Now, what else you don't know? And she's saying she's always think that Divine Feminine is the better woman. Damn. That's messed up when somebody else's mother bringing up the ex-girlfriend in your damn face. That's messed up. What else you don't like, Mama Comet? I mean, Mama Masculine, about this comment? She says she know that you be hating her son. And she told her son not to put her hands on people, children, women, women. But uh, she know you be putting your hands on my on her child. The next card that come out is man abuse. Mm. Man. Mm. You be putting your hands on people. What else you don't like, mama? Mm. And she says she don't like you ghosting her child to be with your fake ass friend. What else don't you like, Mama Comet? Mama Masculine, sorry. She said she don't like that you need her private eye all up in her child's business. And she said how she know that you need her private eye? Because you watching her son and she watching you, Comet. Mm. So since we know how Divine Masculine Mother feel about you, Comet, how do Comet's mother feel about you masculine? Mm. And the first card that wanted to fly out, she said she know that you like to have sex with multiple people without condoms on. This card came out, do we have to? I like it raw. So the comic mother that knows that you like to have sex and she says that she knows since you've been watching, baby, she know that you watching other females. Mmm. And she says she don't think you have the strength to deal with her son. You's a weak ass nigga. You a weak ass nigga. And you need to get your strength up. What else is you saying, Mama Comic? Mama Comic is off the chain. Mm. What else is you saying, Mama Comic? And this one was turned over. What is that? Oh, God. Divine Masculine is saying... Divine Masculine Mother, Divine Masculine Mother, you wrong for this one. That's Divine Masculine Mother, you wrong for this one. Divine Masculine Mother is telling the common mother that her child has told her that he is in regrets for fucking with your daughter. She is his worst nightmare. And the next call come out is regrets. So Mama Masculine is taking shot, 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 shots at this comment. Mama Masculine said, my son has regrets for fucking with your daughter. He said, she is his worst nightmare. Damn, that's messed up. And Mama Masculine said, yeah, my son also told me his heart is an icebox for that bitch. She don't fuck with her. Damn, Mama Masculine, you cold as ice. That was cold-blooded. That was cold-blooded. And she said, yeah, your daughter, she tired of your daughter taking her son through all this cognitive dissonance with all this drinking. He's getting DWIs messing with this one. Driving while intoxicated. Driving while, what is it? Driving under the influence. Yeah, that's what it is. Mm. And she said she know about all them damn abortions that your daughter get because she don't be knowing who her baby father is. Your daughter is a comic. Oh, mama masculine. Oh, and she saying, yes, this is how she keep me. This is how she keeping my child in bondage and all those things with sex. 
But you need to tell your daughter to keep her pussy in her pants. Cause she always giving my child STDs. Girl, I'm gonna need you to stop that line. Both of them be giving STDs among each other. Girl, oh my God, Mama Maxman, what else you gotta say? And she's saying, yes, your daughter need to stop chasing my son. Cause my son is trying to chase other females because he really don't want her. Oh, and I'm gonna drop the mic on there cause I'm not even gonna get into this Mama Masculine. No, yes I am cause I got to see what is Mama Comics response. Mm. Mama's response is, yeah girl, I know my daughter be cheating on your son. That's cause your fuck. That's cause your son is broke as fuck. So she has to go out and go with other men that have means to take care of her because your son always spending his money on other things besides taking care of my daughter. So therefore she have to go out there and have sex with other men to get money. And the next call comes out is paid for sex. Yes. So Mama Carmick knows that her daughter is out there laying and playing for them daughters. Okay? Yes. And Mama Comic said, yeah, and your son is never satisfied. He's never satisfied. He's always cheating on my daughter. That's why I don't like him. And he broke his shit. This came in reverse. The money came in reverse. Yes, so Mama Carmen is saying, yes, my daughter be out there doing whatever it is that she do with other people. It's because your son ain't got no goddamn money and he broke. Damn. Mama Carmen. Mama Carmen, serious. Mm. What else is you saying, Mama Carmen? And she saying, yeah, I know that my daughter do spells because I told her the shit. Hmm. What you got to say about that? What? I told her the shit. And what? And you stupid too. Both of y'all stupid. Because I wouldn't tell nobody that I'm, I, I taught my, my daughter how to be a dumbass and do spells on somebody. You sound stupid, Mama Carmen. That's why your ass for over there messed up having all that cognitive dissonance. Because you over there doing spells too. You done taught your daughter that dumb shit. Stupid is is stupid damn dudes. Stupid is is stupid. And at the bottom of the deck, we have therapy. Yes. Holy Spirit, I'm glad you had to let these two know. Holy Spirit said both of y'all need therapy. And the next call that comes out is seeking therapy. What else you got to say, Holy Spirit, about these two crazy mamas? Holy Spirit said both of y'all, both of y'all messed your kids up as a child. And this next call comes out was... I was scared as a child. So whatever you was doing, Mama Master, your child was messed up, was messed up and scared. And the same thing for you, Mama Carmen. But for y'all kids, this is why they always want people around them. This is why they get in the entanglements because they was lonesome and neglected as children. Oh, God. And y'all always talk about y'all won't blame the damn kids. What did the mamas do? Where was the mamas at? Too busy out in the damn street picking other things besides their damn kids. And now that's why the kids is messed up as adults. Stupid. Mm-hmm. And the next one come out is drug addictions. This is why the comic and divine masculine drinks and smokes and pop pills and do all these things. Because they have dysfunctional family dynamic. And the next call that comes out is drug addictions what else is the comic and the masculine going through yes this is why because when the comic don't get what she wants divine masculine don't do what she tell her to do she does this magic and she seeks assistance from her friends to do this magic because it's okay because the comic mother has told her daughter these comic ways and the next card that comes out is I do magic. Tag team hate. Friends helping hate from the gate to do magic. So they tag team in magic. Yes. And this is why, comic mother, you sit there and you condone your daughter having sex with people for money. This is why this chick is always in the energy where she's looking up symptoms and she's online because she's always having STDs. 
Yes. And she's under judgment for that. And I'm going to leave on that one. Mama masculine and mama common is under judgment for how stupid they are and in their narcissistic ways as children, as adults. Excuse <coughs> me. Excuse me. Step up. Thank you, my way. Thank you. Girl, I don't know why you want to go to sleep right there anyway. You know you're not even supposed to be in that kitchen. Okay. So, let's just go on without a daily thing because these mamas they is depressing seriously i see why both of y'all children messed up whoever um children these are because this is messed up how they act to their children y'all think these behaviors is okay mama masculine you condone her behavior and mama comic you say it's okay for your daughter to go out and sell herself because somebody else ain't getting money which you would have told your daughter to get her own stuff and have her own money then she wouldn't have to go out there and sell herself if you was out there being a mother and protecting your child then she wouldn't be a uh, an, uh someone that got molested and always have to have somebody around child you have to look at adults and how they act what was your childhood like? I asked a lot of people that. Pray always. Yes. Says Luke 21, 36. What else did? I'm going to move one from the middle. Let not your heart be troubled. Neither let you not be afraid. Says John 14, 27. And I'm going to say, if you like my vibe, like, share, and subscribe. I thank you for coming over here with your love, your light, your energy. I thank you for coming over here for liking, sharing, and subscribing. And I hope this helped with your journey um, on how Divine Masculine acts. How the common acts. Because both of them had messed up childhoods. When you sit over here and you see how people act, you got to look at their childhood and what was their family structure. This is what I do. But have a good one. I hope this helped you on your journey. And be great on purpose because you are.